Hey everybody, we are doing the Cayuna Mine Pits again. Today is the example of why you do the Cayuna Mine Pits when it, there's no wind and there is sunshine. Oh. <laughs> I can't wait. I got here late. It's a long, long drive from where I live, but I'm hoping to get those turquoise waters today. Let's go adventure. So these lakes are often referred to as the Cayuna Mine Pits by us kayakers anyways. Uh, so these lakes were created by iron mining that began in 1907 and they were mining for the manganese rich iron that was found here uh, and that is used to harden steel. So this hill right here is where all the trees fall in the water as it rains and erodes away. And all these trees just keep falling in and creating more of a little bit of a tree graveyard, I guess. In 1953, the Cayuna Range uh, production peaked at 3.5 million tons of iron was mined. Like a bird on a tree I'm just sitting here I got time It's clear to see From up here the world seems small We can see This is the island um, that I always stop and have lunch at Whether I'm with a group or by myself The water is so clear, it's a great, great swimming spot When you go up on the island, wait until you see the views. Sometimes you need to go and take a step back to see the truth. You can tell happens with this water um, it's turned to this beautiful peachy coral color beautiful I've never been on this island 
This is the first. I guess we've just never had time. Oh my gosh, those eagles are talking. It's so great. This is absolutely stunning view. this skinny little island. It's really thick. And it's really weird because it's like hollow ground when you walk. It's making me nervous. Like, I think you could just collapse to, I don't know. So it's pretty wild on this island. Oh, the views. Just beautiful. Wow. The fall colors. Oh my gosh. I'm trying not to pant because it's all uphill. <laughs> oh my gosh. Huge favor from you if you are enjoying this video if you could please do me a favor and give it a thumbs up and if you could subscribe to my channel that would be amazing I am trying to get to a thousand subscribers thanks so much Minnesota's worst mining disaster happened here at the Iron uh, Range on, in Cuyuna, where 41 miners lost their lives when one of the underground mines collapsed. So that was pretty tragic. Um, but in 1961 through 1965, 17 mines were closed. And then by 1967, the last operating underground mine was closed. And then it was uh, finished. And the last actual shipment that went out of that iron ore was in 1982. In 1993, local representatives created the Cuyuna County State Recreation Area, where you can go today. And there's beautiful, beautiful biking trails and uh, kayaking on this lake is absolutely stunning. So I highly recommend.
oftentimes there are um, scuba divers that will come to this lake, then they'll go down to the deep depths. And I'm sure that that skeleton was supposed to be down at the bottom, lodged, and it became dislodged and uh, was just there to scare the crap out of me. (laughs) I was like, oh my gosh, this is it. This is the day I finally find a body floating in the water. But it was not. Um, So no, you're not normally going to see skeletons uh, floating in the water there. But um, it is a little creepy when you're by yourself, all these trees. (laughs) It has a peg leg. And a parrot on his shoulder. (laughs) Okay, that's funny. This is one of the most peaceful moments of my life, and I will never forget it. Here's an example of why you have to go to really experience this when there's no wind, because when there's any ripples in the water, you cannot see the trees down below. So you won't catch me doing a lot of lakes just because I need a little more excitement, but Some of the lakes have the most beautiful shoreline. You can kind of tuck into these little coves and just see the most beautiful bits of nature. It's very, very pretty. Take time to enjoy, you guys. Don't just fly by everything. You'll be amazed at the little things that you'll see if you just take the shorelines. Uh, There's just so much to appreciate in nature.
Thank you.